Hey guys, I am Adam. Welcome to the Vintage Sanctuary. My hair is not ready for public consumption, so I put this visor on. If I took it off, it would be truly hairlarious. Okay, I think I need to cut down on the number of puns. Um, you know, I don't usually listen to the pundits, but they tell me my channel has just been uh, pundemonium lately, so I'm going to see if I can cut back. What? What's that? Are, are you serious? Sweet, thank you. Hey, I just learned that this video got a BBB rating. Now that's not the Better Business Bureau, that's the beautiful Bowman Barra rating. So check this beauty out. 1953 Bowman Color Yogi Berra. Groundbreaking photography. This is just such a stunning, gorgeous card. Notice it's been given a grade of Vintage Greatness 3. The 3 stands for Tremendous. I mean, this card is just so incredibly sweet. And then check out the back. can be a little bit hard to see because PSA put one of those uh, soft sleeves in there but I guess they thought it was needed for uh, protection. Basically, when you've got a gem mint vintage card like this, you, you wanna keep it that way. This card is just absolutely gorgeous. Now, uh, you know that Doug from Decon, that's D-K-A-H-N, is just a really awesome guy with a, a great channel. And uh, I only mentioned that so you could see, not only see uh, Yogi Berra in the dugout here, but also see him in the Doug shoutout as an added bonus. Oh, that was bad. All right, uh, let's talk about Yogi Berra just a little bit. Uh, this dude um, got MVP votes in 15 different seasons, which is just outrageous. And then of course he was the MVP of the American League in three different seasons. And uh, he's got some World Series records. Correct me if I'm wrong, but he's played the most games in, in a World Series or the World Series that he was in. He's got 14 World Series appearances. He has the most World Series rings as a player at 10. He has the most World Series at-bats, the most World Series hits, the most World Series doubles, and he caught the only World Series perfect game thrown by Don Larson in 1956. So as you know, I'm a big fan of Yogi Berra and uh, such a great person, such an amazing personality. So let's take another look at this stunning beauty up close. I mean, why is this a three instead of a 10? Well, that's a good question. Okay, maybe it's technical grade is three. What do I know? But I appeal, <laughs> the I appeal of this card, in my humble opinion, is just way off the charts. Thank you for sharing in my joy. I hope you had a wonderful and peaceful time in the Vintage Sanctuary.